Are you tired of absolutely incinerating your retinas using your full-size practice tree? What if I told you for the price of whatever this thing costs you at your local hardware store, you can dim your national event size practice tree from port -a tree Woo! What we have here is a 600 watt rotary dimmer switch. This thing has four wires on the back and we're only going to use two. We are not going to use the green ground wire and we are not going to use the second red wire which is intended for a three-way application. We're only going to be using the black and the one red one that is not the special red one. Start by removing the back cover off of your full-size practice tree to access the wiring. So what we're looking for is the white neutral wire coming right out of the 110 volt plug before that wire goes anywhere, that's where we're gonna be cutting it. That's where we're gonna be splicing in the dimmer switch. You wanna make sure you find the right place to do this. You wanna make sure that the entire tree and all the bulbs are affected by the dimmer switch. So make sure that you do this right after that power is coming in to the back of the tree. Simply chop that wire, get yourself a strippers, strip the wire, then connect the dimmer switch in series, in line with that white neutral wire. My dimmer switch came with some wire nuts, so we're just gonna wire nut it in line on that white neutral wire. Get them babies nice and tight, and you are ready to go. Ladies and gentlemen, it is that easy. That's all it takes. My dimmer switch does have a push on off feature, so you may have to cycle that to get the tree working the first time, just in case it is in the off position. Here you can see some side-by-side -side comparisons of the tree at full brightness versus full Dim. It is important to note that the LED bulbs are still very, very bright, but this dimmer is a significant improvement. It is definitely going to be saving the eyeballs, as with it at full brightness, it's absolutely obnoxious. These bulbs are meant for outdoor use in the sunshine. The sun is bright, boys. Getting these LED bulbs dimmed down to a manageable level will allow you to use your full-size practice tree inside of your garage or in your basement indoors during the off season when you need to be using it. it makes it much more user friendly on the eyes. Also well note that it does dim the pre-stage and the stage bulbs and it seems to dim them significantly more since they're not LEDs, they're not super, super bright to begin with. Those bulbs are really dim when you have the dimmer setting all the way down. Uh, I think the right answer may be to look for some yellow LED you know, screw in light bulb style bulbs to put into the pre-stage and the stage. Maybe that will brighten them back up and kind of put them back in line with how the rest of the tree is lit. But for me, I'm just stoked that I can turn that brightness down finally and do some repetitive hits without absolutely scalding the inside of the eyeballs, boys. So that's pretty much it. After that, you can get creative and mount the dimmer switch on the back of your practice tree, however you best see fit. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like, subscribe, drop a comment down below. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Later.